The encounter is our opening to the life of Leo Teo. It was made to help pull your attention in, and help you follow Leo in his footsteps as we start the story out simply, rather casually, just as it started an RP sequence back in the day. The opening was purely written by me, main director. Reason for this was so I could introduce the idea of writing the full story with secondary director, my old friend, creative and spirited, and actress of Leila. The first chapter was purely based off the first LOL RP sequence that started it all. I worked with basic scenes from memory of that day's episode, just adjusted the concepts of it to help it flow better and connect on to older ideas, which I felt would be best to introduce into the story sooner. <coughs> The main thing I had to work by was knowing how it began. The moment we see Lewa coming down the jungle path, and then bumps into Marine, who didn't have as deep of a history when Lewa was first started. These two occurrences were the building blocks of the episode, and were actually acted in the ASL RP style. Extra details were of course added, things that couldn't be played but imagined during acting, like what Lewa was looking at as he strolled through the market. Marine's situation, which is kept secret at first, but made clear as being serious, wasn't known during starter days of RP. Since we were acting on the fly, each episode was a surprise, and in the case with Marine, I sort of just made some concept from the top of my head that she was a princess and guardian of her kingdom, and that something evil was going on in her palace. Those concepts weren't known till later, when we played the episodes involving deeper details on her character. The concept of Marine being a princess and guardian existed before the LOL story started. I just took the concept a bit further in this universe, and used it to add some interest. So with these ideas already in mind, sometime down the road, I wrote this first chapter in such a way that it would feed into following episodes of LOL, where Lewa goes to help Marine a little later. A sense of character build, basically, and a way to chain link a story like a series. I remember that during RP days in this episode, Lewa spoke with an Agori who told him about the women of Jungle Regions and also mentioned about arena competitions being held for anyone. When I started writing this scene, I couldn't remember who this Agori was. I do believe he was just an anonymous jungle Agori. But I decided to make the character more personal and carry him into the next episode. This is when I slipped in Flame, another character who existed beforehand, just became a good friend of Leo's in this universe. I found it worked so much better to introduce Flame early in the story, though from what I recall he was a later character who never had too big of a role in the series, until I made him an immediate character in first chapter. Introducing Flame, to me, helped make you feel more connected with the characters, and also made an opening for second, care, seven, second chapter, which further introduces more characters of the story, including ones from the previous chapter, a day before. The rest of first chapter is based solely off a small acted sequence of Lewa taking a walk through the jungle, though he was warned not to and for the first time in his life is cornered by the Nimbus, the most beautiful woman he's ever seen, and green on top of that. In starter days, the Nimbus was added as a mysterious character, but her character became very important in the story, and is why LOL as a series exists. During playtime, me and my friend just winged things, and I wasn't planning on making the story take a turn towards romance, but I had a feeling it would. Judging by the look by my friend had in her eyes while we played Lewa, I could tell she thought the hinting was cute, so we went with it and soon it became a love story. So yeah, I was expecting that to happen, and I was fine with it. Good thing too, otherwise the story wouldn't be what it is. I wrote this chapter solely based off of the three scenes mentioned, and hope to carry it further as we go on in story. Overall, the small RP episode became rather important for the rest of LOL, and was made more complex in writing than it was when first acted. Cool, huh? One small episode was based off three quickly acted scenes that were a test run RP episode. Leo walking down the path, bumping into Marine, talking with an Agori, playing, and became cornered, and being cornered by a mysterious woman, his heart instantly enchanted by. Such simple scenes, which later became the base elements of this chapter, and important openings for future episodes.